is Poundland actually cheaper than your regular supermarket? I did not expect this. This is proving to be difficult. I was shocked. Poundland actually are doing something very, very cheeky. And this is why we make these videos. Because What's happening, Free Game? We are coming to you live. But not live. From our home in London. Yes, let us know where in the world you guys are coming. Live but not live from. We love hearing from you and where you are in the world. Today, guys, we have another fun shopping challenge video. Yes, our favorite type of challenge, guys. So recently, we did a shopping challenge at Poundland where we tried to get our weekly food shop from Poundland, only from Poundland. And we were quite surprised by the results, weren't we? We were, yes. Yes, check that video out, guys, if you haven't already. But it got us thinking. Hmm, mm. yeah. Is Poundland actually cheaper than your regular supermarket. So today guys, we are gonna put that to the test. So this is the way it's going to work. We're gonna to go to Poundland and we are going to find all of their top branded products. And then we're gonna to go to Tesco's and find the exact same products. Yeah, the reason why we chose Tesco is because they are the UK's biggest supermarket and they boast about having a price match with Audi, so they're quite competitive when it comes to prices. Mm, but do they price match with Poundland though? Mm. I'm gonna make a prediction though. I've got a feeling it might be Tesco's. No way. Are you serious? Yeah, because we're all led to believe that Poundland is like cheap, 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 discounted store. But what if Tesco's beats it? I think Tesco's might No be way, Poundland all day. Comment below, Free Gang. Who do you think will win this and be the cheaper brand? Tesco's or Poundland? Comment below. Are you Team Poundland or Team Tesco's? No, I think Tesco's has got a good chance. They're no good way. offers. They do have Poundland good Poundland all day. Well, enough of us squabbling. Let's go and find out. So Poundland is up first, guys. We've got Jojo here. Hello. He's good at picking out some good old branded products. I'm good at picking out the snacks. Snacks, is that what you're up for, eh? Yeah. It could be very snacky today, we never know. So, what are you thinking? Who's gonna be cheaper, Poundland or Tesco's? I reckon some of the things we might be getting, possibly Poundland. Ooh, oh, okay, you, that's oh. what I reckon. She reckons Tesco. Really? Yeah. I was surprised too. Right, well, let's go in Poundland, get this underway. Basket, Jojo? Basket's ready. Price pounders, what does that mean? I don't know. It's like it's got a tick, like it matches, like, like it's like a price match. So what we're going to have to really think about here is not only getting branded products, but just hoping that Tesco's happening as well, right? Yeah, Tesco's, Tesco's do everything. Most stuff, yeah. yeah. So we've got our first product. San Pellegrino, Bob loves these. I think these are 65p here. I can't see where it came from because it was, like, it was one left. But... I can't see Tesco's beating that. They see? Were, they were 65p last time we came. So, so quick question, are we including other things than food? Yeah, let, let, we can include other things like toilet roll or, I don't know, shampoos, things like that. Okay. Branded products, so other things, yeah. As long as they sell them in Tesco's, then we can get them. So we're looking at toilet roll and tissues right now? I don't think they'll do a small one like that at Tesco's. Okay, what about tissues though? Kleenex? £1.50. Is that good? Is that I cheap? I so. don't know. We'll see. This is where it could get super snacky. What was that little sound you just made there? I didn't make a sound. I don't know what you're talking you're about. Mm. What are you saying, Jojo? Lotus Biscoff. Yes, good shout. How much are they? A pound twenty-five. Ooh. Okay. Okay, some of these I'm not certain about at the moment. We could essentially get every pack of biscuits here. <laughs> Oh, these ones. Are they vegan as well? Yep. Ritz crackers are a well-known accidental vegan product. Are they? Yeah. Mm. Famous for it. What you got your eye on now? Jamie Dodgers. Oh. Jamie, Jamie loves these. Interesting. So that's a family pack. Yeah. So we have to find exactly the same one. Oh, what about party rings? That's just party a, rings. That's a single pack. How much is it? Pound? Pound for them. See, Tesco's. Tesco's no point. No, really? Confident are we? I get a feeling we could be spending a whole lot of time in this snack area right now. I know. Crumpets. So many. Crumpets. Yep. King's milk crumpets. We get those. They are. I reckon. I reckon Poundland's gonna win on this one. The pound. They're a pound. Yeah. The land of the pound. That's true to their word. 
mostly. More bready stuff? Yeah, we'll get a nice loaf of bread, and this is £1.40. If you remember in the last video, we managed to get this cheaper because it was reduced, but we can't go for the reduced ones in this video because it wouldn't be fair. And something to spread on the bread. Oh, that's naughty, isn't it? Biscoff spread. Have you ever had that? Oh my god. No, I haven't. So you've got something else to spread? Peanut butter. That is 175 in here and jam is 125. These two go very well together. I get a feeling though, 175, that's quite high for a really? small jar like that, right? Okay. You well, know, you're, you're the price lady when it comes to supermarkets. We'll, we'll find out. I'm starting to think Tesco's is gonna win now. Oh, you switching sides already? Yeah. Unbelievable, traitor. Okay. What? Also, I was thinking cereal. Ah, yeah, there's oh, lots wheat. of different cereal. What about Wheatabix? The British classic. Four pounds. Wow. And Sammy, I can give this to Sam as well. He loves this. Yeah. He loves we'll it. give it as a moving in present. Oh, also, Astrid loves them as well. Oh, you? yeah. Mm -hmm. Where are you heading to? <laughs> <laughs> That's that then, eh? One pound, yeah. I remember you complaining about them being a pound They're before. Quite expensive. Well, we'll see compared to Tesco's. But they're not even the king size ones. You get the bigger ones. They're normally a pound. This is close to your heart, isn't it? Pot noodle prices. Yes. <laughs> You've switched to the other snack area very quickly there. Yes. Yeah, okay, yes. They're good. Ah, you have found a king size one now. Just one random king size one. But is there any have... price for it anywhere? No. Well, maybe we should get it, just see what price it comes out with and then compare it to Tesco's. Got to get them beans. 275, that's pretty cheap. I remember that from the last challenge. But it's a four pack, isn't it? Yeah. Mummy, we've just made a great discovery what? in the frozen section. Come and have a look. They got the new vegan magnums, the raspberry ones. Oh, how much are they? We're not sure. Oh, it doesn't have a price to, here. We'll get them and then we'll see when we get to the checkout on Monday. Did you just sniff and then make a price out of that? Yes. Okay. If I knew it was that easy, eh? More snackage, I see. Yeah, we used to have these when we were kids, but we've not had them since we've been vegan, but these ones are, because they're prawn cocktail. So you're not only doing a challenge here, but you're getting a bit of nostalgia in as well, eh? Yeah. I hope they do them at Tesco's. I will be the first one to taste test them, though, just to make sure that they taste like they did when we were kids. We almost forgot the other ice cream that we know they have here. Ben and Jerry's cookie dough ice cream. This is only two pounds, and I've got a feeling Poundland is going to win on this one. I think we might need to get a secondary basket. Look how full this one okay, is. You're right. Let's go. Meanwhile, we'll look at the frozen stuff. So we've got a few different branded products here. One pound fifty. That's good. Also one pound fifty. And chips. And these are only one seventy-five. They've also got jacket potatoes up there. Yeah, I think these, that three pounds does seem expensive for those though. Okay. But we'll get them anyway. What's next, mommy? I was looking for the Owl Pro. They had Owl Pro in here for one pound uh, last time we were in here, but they completely sold out. Well, we can't count it then, can we? No. Maybe people saw us buying it net last time and went, oh, that's a good idea, and then it sold out. And they all just charged down here together, a big group of people. They do have the chocolate dessert that we got last time. Where they have a camarel. Camarel? Camarel? Who's camarel? Camel. Camel. Cam no. Camel. <laughs> You're giving me the hump getting this wrong. <laughs> hey, caramel. Shall I get it? Yes. Just get some camel dessert in there. What you found there, Daddy? Some oat cakes, which are one pound fifty. Oh, that's quite sounds healthy, quite good. tasty ones as well with sea salt. Oh, nice. Okay, put them in. So we are all done here, guys. We've got every branded product that we could find. So now what we've got to do is head to Tesco's and do the exactly same thing, get the exactly same products. We're going to get a trolley this time because last time we needed two baskets. Isn't that interesting? The first product we find in both places. No, 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 they're all, they're all. Oh, yeah, making sure we get the exact same flavor, eh? Yeah, I jumped over to look behind. We, okay, we want to do this properly. Okay, we got this one. Jojo, I feel like you strayed from the challenge. You've gone to Lego again. Let's have a look. We'll do a Lego challenge at some point, okay? I feel like this part is easier because we know exactly what we've got to get. We've just got to find where it is. Okay, which tissues was it? 
This one, but it was in a longer pack. Was it in that one? No? No, it was It was in this one, but in long, longer pack. So what do we do in this case if we can't find the exact equivalent? It's the same, but it's just like in, it was are, a longer pack. Are they shaped different? Yeah. Okay. There's less, there's less, likely less in this one, but these are 225. So bread, yeah, that's right. And we've also got crumpets to get. Yeah, £1.30, so these are 10p cheap. I remember the price. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. I see why you started leaning towards Tesco. This is going to be interesting. Oh, yes. don't you start getting smug right now. It's not over yet. Okay. Was it King's Mill crumpets as well? They don't have the King's Mill crumpets, um, so we can't do a comparison with that. But it's all right. We've got lots of other stuff to do comparison with, so that's fine. I wanted two packs of crumpets. This has ruined everything. <laughs> I don't want two packs of crumpets. I know, let's go and salt. Cereal aisle. I can't even remember. What did we get? Oh, Weetabix. Weetabix. Yes. Am I right thinking they don't have the same size? Or is that just a different shape? No, 36. There's 36 in the box. How many is that in that pack, though? 48. Oh, this is proving to be difficult. I thought this would be the easiest part. Can't we get a 12 and a 24 to make 36? Or does it not work that way? I'll tell you what, we'll, get, we'll work it out per biscuit. That's the best thing to do. That's the one. What one is it again? Cam uh, Camarel. What? Ha? Hang on. Rum. Caramel. Caramel. Yeah. How much is it? 150 club one. card price. Have we got a club card with us? We do, but I think we. No, 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 no. We've got to go. Everyone's got a club card these days. We've got okay. to go with a club card price. Comment below if you've got a club card. Not if you're a Poundland person. Anyway, at least we've got those. £1.50. So we've got the four pack of Heinz baked beans. $3.99, which is, which is more expensive than Poundland. Yeah. And it says they're price matched with Aldi, but they're not price matched with Poundland, are they? Jojo, I'm expecting you to run in at any moment. These ones, £1.20, that's expensive. I told you last time that £1 was cheap. You're in shock here, aren't you? No. Having to face up to defeat already. No. Jojo, mummy's getting snacktacular. We've got certain items to stick to. Don't get carried away, okay? Although, a lot of biscuits hang about. So this is the Jammy Dodgers jumbo pack as well, but I swear there was 12 of them. Not 16, or am I wrong? No, there was 12. This is so confusing. <laughs> okay, we were a bit confused at first, but we figured out that Poundland actually are doing something very, very cheeky. Same pack at Tesco's has 16 biscuits altogether. We bought exactly the same one, it had 12. But you would look at it and, and think it was the same. Yeah, same with this snack pack. They look exactly the same and yet this one has 248 grams in it. And what did the other one have? It was 186 grams. So it basically worked out that you had 12 packs of two biscuits in the Poundland one, but this is 16 packs of two so biscuits. So Poundland are making you think you're getting the same thing cheaper. We've seen it with so many things so far, so I did not expect this. You wouldn't bother to look, it's only because we're doing this challenge that we're looking at how many grams there are in each one. Yeah, so these are £1.50 and these are 170 what surprises are in store this time? <laughs> Can we get, get another box of these and it just be the same? Okay, 200 grams. That's the same, isn't it? I don't think it is. Really? It looks exactly the same as the one in Poundland. Yeah, these are £1.25 anyway. Okay, I've just checked. The ones we got, 165 grams. And they look the same. This doesn't this box look exactly That's so the same. deceptive. Poundland. You're hurting me here. Okay, just found these fine milled oat cakes. Can you remember how much these were? I can't Pound remember, land. but they are one they're one thirty here. in here. Yeah, I have no idea if they're the same amount. I can't trust anything anymore. I, I, I feel like this challenge is like shocking me to the core already. I'm just like, <gasps> I feel like I've been deceived and lied to. I know. I thought Poundland would always be cheaper for the same products. But, but this like, is their trick, clearly. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see though what the difference is though per packet or weight, whatever. When well, we I, want, I want to see how many items they've done this with when we get home. Okay, you're in charge of Chris, Jojo. You got the. It is a six pack. It is a six. We that's did. not a nine. It's not like painted on or anything. Yeah, we did get a six pack, and that's one pound forty. We also need some. What's it called? What's it? Oh, that's it. Is it those ones? They're giants. Giant. Is that what? the same one? They weren't. They weren't big, giant. were they? No, they're 
they're not giant ones. Okay, found what's it's, but they're not the prawn cocktail ones. So we'd want the equivalent, but we don't have the same flavor. And these okay. ones aren't vegan, so we won't no. get them as a comparison. I think I found the jam. Is it this one? Heart Lee's? Yes, £1.70. I can't remember how much it is, but we'll check when we get home. <laughs> Who knows if it's the same size or what? It's, it seems like the same size, but I'd be shocked if that is more. Could be four grams different. And now we need some packed peanut butter. Katie's decided to volunteer as a staff member. Right, I'm pretty sure that's a bigger jar. Definitely that bigger. That is bigger. The other one had 200 grams in it. This one has 400. Oh, so we could just do a half price comparison maybe. Okay. This, and this is three pounds uh, five, so. Oh, 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 no. Is that them? There's a lot of green cuisine stuff. Just want the veggie fingers, simple. It's the same price, one pound fifty. So we need the chips. Aren't oh, Bessie's chips though? Ah, uh, they don't have that brand though, do they? No chips, but we got waffles. Ah. Oh. oh, they're at it again. <laughs> Ten pack. We but you would think it's the same. The box You'd is think the same. It's the same. But they've had eighteen. Oh. Katie, calm yourself down, all right? No, I can't. They're on their last legs with this. Four jackets. Oh, same price, three pounds. Yeah, but that's the club card price. Yeah, not everyone's got a club card price. Well, Poundland don't need you to sign up for a membership to get have, this. We have got a club card price. Three, three pounds, four in there. But I wonder how, what the weight is. <laughs> no. Check the weight. Oh, okay. and these, we got these. Did we not? Yeah, we, uh, they haven't got the new one, the Raspberry Swirl. But no. I'm sure it's all the same. They've got more variety. They've got the classic vegan almond, vegan sea salt caramel, which I think we should get you as a what, comparison. Mommy, mommy. What, vegan sea salt and what? Camera. Oh, stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Should we get any old one? Yeah, get the sea salt caramel maybe. Oh, yeah, what and the Ben and Jerry's. The Ben and Jerry's. What was that one though? It was like cookie dough. Should we get fudge brownie? Yeah. They're all the same price, I think, anyway. I don't think with the difference of flavour, the price changes. Okay. So I think it's a safe bet just to get the same so right. sort of one. You getting the bars as well? Can I get the nutty one? Okay. Goes with you, Natty. Or oh, sea salmon. Yeah, that, I was telling you about sea salt caramel. Yeah, what? yeah. Just don't make me say the words again, mate. Say what words? Sea salt? That oh. one's more expensive. I'm getting this one. <laughs> <laughs> so, that's all done for Tesco. Some shocking revelations already about the differences between prices and sizes and weights and everything. Poundland, dude. Oh, man. I'm, I'm, I'm playing shocked. with my heart here, Poundland. Yeah, Poundland. I was rooting for you. Now I feel like you betrayed me. Anyway, it's going to be really exciting to get home and compare this all, which is what we're going to do now. Okay guys, we are back with two hauls of food, one from Poundland, one from Tesco's, both with identical products. Kind of identical. Mmm, yes, exactly. Well, there's a few surprises in there. I knew this would be interesting, but it was way more interesting and way more surprising than I expected. Yes. So what we're going to do, guys, we're going to compare the prices, product to product, from Poundland to Tesco. However, as some of them, as we found out, are different in size or in weight, we will be comparing like per 100 grams. And then at the end, rather than doing a total difference in price, we'll tell you which store has gotten the most products with the lower price. And so that will help us to figure out which is cheaper, Poundland or Tesco's. Okay, chuck out the ones that we couldn't find a match for. There was a similar product, it was different in shape and size and everything, so it wasn't a comparable product, so. Oh. I wanted to try the giant ones. No. And there's also- Party rings. They, they didn't did, have the same ones. They had the bags of the small ones, but Not they the didn't have one. ones like this. What we found, very, very shocking, which you'll find when we go through this haul, is that there's certain things like we to bix we didn't mind the difference so much because they come in so many different sizes anyway, don't they? Yeah. And you, you can buy all kinds of different sizes of them. So we weren't, we weren't too shocked about that, but it was when we had product products like this that looked I identical. They looked the same in size and everything, but then when you got closer and you put them together and you're like, there's 40 grams difference. This one's got 340, this one's got 300. And I would have never thought to look at the grams. That's I, what they plan on though, I bet, eh? Yeah, so Poundland did a lot of that. They look like looking like they were identical products and yet smaller than the other ones. But we'll see if it's worth it in the sense of price per 100 grams. Yeah. First one, pop noodle. If these are different in size, I'm gonna be cross. No, very same size. One pound for Poundland, 
£1.20 at Tesco's. A pound wins. Next is Kleenex. This is where it got confusing. We actually had to weigh these it with our own scales just to figure out a difference in price. So this one from Poundland works out at £1.4 per 100 grams. And this one works out at £1.20 per 100 grams. So Poundland wins again. So next up is the baked beans. Uh, this is our Poundland. I've got to check each tin to make sure they were all the same. Did you? I knew this would be the same. Yeah. So for Poundland it was £3.25. And these were £3.99. So Poundland again. Okay. Next up, Skips. Lovely prawn cocktail flavoured crisps. At Poundland, these were two pounds. And Tesco's, it was one pound 40. Wow. Tesco's wins. Okay, San Pellegrino. This one, Ooh. I think, was a very obvious winner. 60p for the one from Poundland. And this one is one pound 25. Double the price. Ooh. Tesco never stood a chance. Next one is the Sun Packed <laughs> Peanut Butter. Look at the size difference. You would see that though. We that's, noticed that straight yeah, away. That's Fine. That's like double the size. So I don't feel like they're trying to con anyone with that. Yeah. It's when they look identical, but there's still a difference. So this is a 200 gram jar for £1.75, 87p per 100 grams. And this is £3.5 for 400 grams, which works out 76p per 100 grams. So Tesco wins that one. Yeah, but you do better when you buy things in a larger size normally anyway. So. Well, we'll see. Mm. Next up is potato waffles. Pound and we're cheeky with this one. Eight pack for £1.50, which worked out. I did it per waffle, that's 19p. You would look at that, those and think that they were the same product. I did. Same size and everything. I think you had to point it out. Yeah, this one has 10 in there. And these were 185, which works out 18p per waffle. So Tesco's win that by about half a penny. Oh, okay. Next up is the jacket potatoes, a four pack. Same weight, same number of potatoes. Same size. And same price, three pound each. Oh, okay. It's a draw. Now this one was cheeky, the Ritz crackers. I had no idea. So look, you can see this one's slightly bigger. Slightly, from Tesco's. but you would think that that is the same size product though, wouldn't you? Yeah, Poundland one was one pound 25 for 165 grams, which works out 76p per 100 grams. And this was one pound 25 for 200 grams. So the same price, but you get more. Okay, so this is better. Yeah. Okay, Tesco's wins that one. Next up is the Alpro Caramel. This is quite an easy one. Four packs, same weight. Poundland's price was one pound. And Tesco's was one fifty. So Poundland wins that one. I wish more of them were that simple. Yes. This one we noticed the Jammy Dodgers. Very cheeky. Poundland, pack of 12, 210 grams, costs £1.25, which works out about 60p per 100 grams. And this pack of 16 was £1.50 and it was 280 grams. And that made Tesco actually cheaper. Tesco were cheaper yeah. with this one. Next is the Weetabix. The really big one, we noticed this difference, didn't we? Because we yes. were looking for a 36 pack in Tesco's. The 36 pack from Poundland cost four pounds. And this was two pound 50 for a 24 pack. Yeah, it still worked out Poundland was better value though. I thought that would be. Per piece of yeah. Weetabix. Next up is veggie fingers. We love these things. Yeah, same weight, same number of veggie fingers, everything, and exactly the same price, one pound 50 each. So yeah. that's a draw. Next up, Kingsmill wholemeal bread. Both of them the same size and everything. And this cost £1.40 at Poundland. And this was one thirty. Let's go to wins. For the jam next. So 300 grams for the Poundland one. Cost £1.25. And this was one seventy. But the Poundland one was better value per 100 grams. So Poundland wins. Was it? Yeah. Oh, I thought they were trying to be sneaky. They were though. So next up is these oat cakes. These must be the same. No, I? they're not. No way. No, no way. Look, 218 grams. Tesco's 250 grams. They look. The boxes. <laughs> they look identical. Poundland's price for these was £1.50. And Tesco's was £1.30. So you get more for 20p less. Oh, so Tesco's won? Yes. Oh, okay. I know. So that was them being very, very cheeky. Yes. Yeah. Next up, Ben and Jerry's vegan ice cream. Same size, same weight, different flavours, but the flavours never change the price, does it? No. Anyway, pound lamb one was two pounds, really good price. Tesco's was five pounds. I could have got two for this. I will never buy this at Tesco's ever again. <laughs> Biscoff biscuits. These cost one pound. And these cost 170. So that must be better value. Yeah, this is definitely better value. Okay. Pound lamb wings. 
And the last one is the vegan Magnums. This one at Poundland was two pounds, which is a really good price That's, for three of them. Yeah. You, you can pay in a shop normally about two pound fifty for one. Yeah. yeah, so two pounds for these. And three pounds for these. So Poundland wins. Okay, we've done some very serious counting here, guys. And I can now announce that the winner with the most products with the lowest prices is Poundland. Do you know what? I, halfway through this challenge, I was shocked because I thought that Poundland were, were like trying to be very sneaky in making these smaller ones. And I thought, oh, the only reason Poundland is cheaper is because there's less in there. But gram for gram, it is actually cheaper. It is better value, but I was quite surprised. There were quite a few ones at Tesco had lower prices for Yeah, them. and this is why we make these videos. I know you guys really, really appreciate these videos. And yeah, we learn something new every we, we time. We were surprised along yeah. the way. There's so much I didn't expect to happen. If I want Heinz beans from now on, I'm getting them from Poundland. If I want Ben and Jerry's ice cream, I'm getting, I'm getting it from Poundland. Anyway, guys, I hope you have found this very helpful. We love doing these videos. Let us know your comments below if you'd like to see something like this with two other stores. We're, we're more than open to doing different ideas of different shopping challenges. So let us know in the comments below. But that's where we're going to say goodbye, guys, and we will see you all in the next video. Just remember, though, no matter where you guys are in the world, always stay free. And just keep rising.